Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Commissar Show. We're continuing our playthrough of Sid Meier's Alpha Centauri. In the last episode, uh, the Lost episodes, I um, had quite a few interrelations with the Believers and the Aliens and a bunch of other factions, and um, basically what happened was the Swaggler Denzel Washington wanted to become my friend because the Aliens were uh, wanting to destroy him. And uh, then the pe then the believers, uh, the Westboro Baptist trip phoned me up because uh, they were pissed off, um, and they wanted to crush me because they didn't like my democracy. Um, and uh, uh, quite a long series of events. I lost Helmus to alien scum. They invaded me and they took over my capital, which really sent everything south. Um, my colonists kind of migrated up here to the top part of the map over here next to these uh, crystals and I tried to reclaim my capital I didn't have the right technology to uh, have units strong enough to capture the city that I wanted to take um, and it was basically just a shit show I lost um, not only that uh, I built the weather paradigm a wonderful structure which lets your workers build units faster or build their uh, things faster um, and in addition to that uh, whew, um, the it played a one of Alpha Centauri's very iconic and unique cinematics which after it played it totally fucked up the capture so everything after that was completely and totally unusable it was very sad, so what I've done uh, is I've disabled cinematics. Um, so it will not be playing cinematics anymore. Um, and hopefully it won't cause any more issues with uh, capture. Um, let's see here. I'm just going to be building some defensive units here. Uh, see if I can prevent my, cap my two cities from being completely ass-fucked. Uh, let's see... Um, and yeah, it was a it was a very long, uh, thirty minute shit show in which I lost all my cities. I was very quiet for a long time because I was just frustrated. And I was trying to concentrate on, um, I was trying to concentrate on, uh, you know, completing the game so that I could, uh, you know, get my cities back. See if I could uh, get a more positive outcome. And I, I was trying to be committed to the decisions that I made uh, and eventually just it went s it's such a long way downhill that I I, I lost uh, aliens and believers uh, captured all my towns and I was uh, sent to the end game screen where it told me I had 1% project completion and that my um, and that my civilization's knowledge had been compressed into a book that was known as the Great Book of Toilet Tank Humor. So, you know, shit jokes is all we're about. And eventually that's all we became to be. So, um, after that long series of very painful events um, and losing the capture twice in a row, um, we have just loaded the old save and we're going to go back to where we left off on the second episode. So to you, it feels like nothing has happened, but to me, uh, it's been a horrible, very long and prolonged experience, and hopefully we are going to um, remedy that situation now that we have a little bit of a foresight as to what's going to happen. Um, we'll just reason that uh, Commissar Christoph of the Pirate Lords ingested some spice melange and was able to glimpse into the future of what might happen between aliens and Morganites and whatever. So um, let's call up Denzel Washington again. Mm, he wants to give me... You know what? Sure. Oh, oops. My bad. I want to call him up. Oh, he's threatening me. Okay, let's be f brothers. And, uh... Okay, good. Look at that. I was like, let's be brothers. And he's like, what do you have to offer? And I was like, my goodwill and friendship. And he's happy with that. So now he's my packed brother. And we are allies now, as far as the game is concerned. I have a copy of his map, and I can also see the university here. He's got three bases. I'm going to call up Brendan Baker. He is also ambivalent towards me. 
but he wants to share some technology. Brandon, this was a lot nicer than how you were in the last... Uh, let's commence with some social engineering, because um, I think I'm going to get rid of democracy, because it had some problems before. Uh, gross inefficiency. Let's just do support units. Okay, we'll, we'll keep what we had before. Brendan, you're asking me for money and he wants to pay me back? You know what? Sure. Because we want to have uh, good relations with Brendan. Because last time when Brendan phoned me up, you threatened me for technology, which apparently you should have had because you're a university faction, and then you eventually declared war on me. But we're not going to do that today. Uh, today we are going to ha make a proposal to you, and I want you to be my pack brother. Uh, okay, you have no feel to need that. Okay, how about name your price? Okay, I mean, Brandon, you're not interested in being my pack brother. You know, I'm a little bit heartbroken by that, but I can work with it. I got a bunch of swag lords backing me up, and as long as you aren't willing to crush my citizens and my town, then we'll be okay. So let's go for field modulation so we can get the very powerful the defensive resonance armor big bill ignoramus what do you have to say she's ambivalent towards me uh... she wants to give me a copy of her world map no thank you and now she's threatening me okay good 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 she wants to pay me for my technology i have a proposal to make let us sign a treaty of friendship and she's happy with that she's obstinate uh... you know i, I gotta read some more because I'm not really sure what obstinate means. Um, we'll, we'll keep moving on. Um, oh, Crab Lord Akak, what do you have to say? Uh, she's threatening me with her residence unit. Well, good. I'll soon have that unit as well. If you pay me, I'll give you tech. And she's giving me tech. Beautiful. Good. We're making great relations. This is a much better improvement than how we were last time around. And Queen B. Beyonce. Um, one thing that also happened last game was I... Uh, the aliens had wiped out Beyonce uh, over here with her beautiful face on the side here before I could even get a chance to speak to her. But now I get to. I get to. Um, she wants me to help her attack the aliens. Um, not yet. No. If you pay me, I'll give you tech. <laughs> Beyonce says, I am a wise and benevolent leader, and to have perceived in these lasting benefits of a free society in difficult times, her hat is off to me. Well, um, hold on. Uh, oops. Please call off. Oh, no. Um, no, 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 no. Come back, Beyonce. I have. Oh, fuck. You slicey fuck. Okay, we're going to move our transports back because I'm afraid that the aliens or in conjunction the horrible and insane Baptists are going to attack me like they did last time. Okay, I can't even get the thing anyway. So let's get some doctors in here. Let's just get the one so far. Maybe the drone rides will end sooner than later. The Baptists constructed the first unit prototype. That's okay. Well, we have now a synth metal coastal ship, which will be set to hold. Good. Now we have field resonation. Good. Now we have three res sentinels. Resonance armor is very good. I have absolutely no idea how good it is versus normal armor. I just know that it, when it comes to defending, it's stronger than regular. So I don't even know what the point is when it comes to... Uh, not like getting it over the uh, the other armor. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's not go for the let's go for the intellectual integrity because we want the citizens' defense force because that makes our towns a bit more um, survivable. So let's see if we can get this thing here. 344. Not yet. Maybe soon. Uh, we're gonna delete the coastal there. Um, let's see. Because last time what I did was I literally just breezed through every single turn. Just enter, 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 enter. Just going turn, 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 turn. And it really ended up shafting me um, in the late game because, you know, 
I had um, I had no units to defend my base. So we want to avoid that happening this time around. We're going to uh, be very, very careful with what we're building and who we're talking to. Let's call up the Destiny's children again. Good. She's ambivalent. I don't really feel like... No. Pay me. No. She doesn't want to pay me. Okay, she wants to give. She wants me to give her a loan. Hopefully that'll make her uh, kinder towards me. What we want to try and do right now is... Uh, unite the factions against the alien scum because while they are around it's going to become very very difficult for me to get to the end of the game because unfortunately uh, as I said in one of the earlier episodes of this uh, series is that um, this game is not balanced very well it's an alien crossfire unfortunately is <sighs> balanced way way worse than the original game was and uh, unfortunately the aliens are m incredibly powerful and we want to be able to wipe them out sooner than later so she's happy Let's have a proposal. Will you be... Let's sign a treaty of friendship. Okay, sure. Why not? Excellent, Commissar Kristoff. This treaty demonstrates that planet is large enough for both your aquatic ambitions and for my covert operations. It also opens the door for trade and commerce between our peoples. May the friendship between the Nautilus navigators and the children last forever. Uh, let's see... Let's swear a pact of brotherhood. Oh, she's not interested. Okay, what do you want for a Pact of Brotherhood? Doctrine Flexibility. Okay, why not? Um, I believe we're finished here. So now we have a, a Vision on her two bases here. Uh, vision, Sound, and Googleplex. So, um, it's actually good news here. You can see this uh, does not look like her original capital, which I guess must be Googleplex. It, it's, um... It's an actually an alien city, so it looks like she's captured the alien cities. So I have a lot more vision now than I had before on this area. Before I had absolutely no idea what was going on this little bit here. So um, I think uh, we're going to go through a few more turns and we might try attacking the aliens. First, let's call up Denzel Washington because he is also my packed brother. He's solicitous. He wants to speak to Destiny's Child in exchange for credits. Yep, sounds good to me. I have a proposal to make. Um, okay, he has no technical data, which I'd be interested in. That's okay. He's beginning this... Okay. Um, it's saying that uh, it's been declared vendetta by the aliens, which is okay so far, because I don't see that they have any... Um, 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 I don't see that they have any uh, seed troops, any boats, so that's okay for me. Um, and uh, we are just going to do a quick save here. Oops. Seeing as how everything's going smoothly so far, we're going to save over our original save. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of The Commissar Show. Have a great night if this is the last episode you're watching. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one.